Hi and welcome to Heatmap Theme News, 4th of July 2014 and a happy Independence Day to all our US members. Today I've got two great things to tell you about. First up, I'll be talking about the latest Heatmap Adaptive update and some cool new widget positions in this theme. Secondly, if you've ever wondered exactly which of your AdSense ad positions performs best on your site, I'll tell you about some great new Click Missile features which will help you optimize your AdSense ad placement. So, let's take a look at the new widget positions in Heatmap Adaptive. As you're probably aware, a few months ago we released Ultimate Silo Storm Pro, and one of the great new features I included in that theme is the ability to insert ad widgets directly between the first three posts in a blog. Well, I've now added the same capability to Heatmap Adaptive version 1.43. As you can see, this blog has got ads placed between the first three posts. So let's take a look at the WordPress widget manager to see these new widget positions. Here you can see the new widget positions blog posts 1, 2 and 3 and these correspond with the end of the first three blog posts. Remember, these widget positions will only appear on home page blog posts, category and tag pages and other archives. They will not appear on pages or posts. You can use either the Heatmap Adaptive Ad Widget or better still, a Click Missile Ad Widget for extra ad placement power. I'm sure you're going to love experimenting with these new ad widget positions on your blog. Next, let's talk about optimizing your AdSense ad placement. If Click Missile is included in your membership, then you'll see a new section in the Click Missile members area called AdSense Split Test Mastery. So what is AdSense Split Test Mastery? Well, the latest Click Missile release version 4.1.3 is now able to integrate with Google AdSense experiments. Google AdSense experiments allows you to test different AdSense ad layouts on the same page or post. Over time, Google Analytics will tell you exactly which ad layout performs best. In the AdSense Split Test Mastery area, I show you how to configure Google Analytics and your theme so you can run these kinds of Google AdSense experiments and create lovely reports like this one. We can see here that Variation 2 is the clear winner. And you're probably looking at this graph right now and asking, what does Variation 2 look like? Well, before I show you, it's important to know that every site is different, so you should grab the latest version of Click Missile, create a Google Analytics account and start doing some of your own experiments to find out what will work for you. Having said that, here is what Variation 2 looks like. It's one ad placed right in the middle after the first paragraph, and I inserted that ad using Click Missile. I hope you have a great time experimenting with your site. Thanks for watching.